immune system in this we will see concept of immunity types of immunity that is innate and acquired structure of antibody formation of antigen antibody complex antigen on blood cells and immune disorders that is allergy and aids concept of immunity immunity is defined as the ability of body to recognize neutralize or destroy and eliminate harmful foreign substances including microorganisms most peculiar characteristics of immune system are it can differentiate between self and non self molecules also it possesses immunological memory any foreign substance invading body and capable of stimulating an immune response is called an antigen the protective chemicals produced by immune system in response to antigen are called as antibodies immunology is the science that deals with the study of immune responses to foreign substances and their role in resisting infection there are two main types of immunity innate immunity and acquired immunity innate immunity also called as non specific natural and inborn immunity innate immunity or non specific immunity refers to the basic resistance to disease that an individual is born with most of the microorganisms encountered by a healthy individual are readily cleared within a few days by this non specific defense mechanisms innate immunity comprises of four types of defensive barriers first is anatomic barriers physiological barriers phagocytic barriers and endocytic barriers inflammatory barriers summary of all these non specific host defenses are as given in the slide acquired immunity also called as specific immunity or adaptive immunity ability of body to defend itself against invading foreign agents like bacteria toxins transplanted tissue is called as specific immunity this resistance or immunity that an individual acquires during lifetime is called as acquired immunity when an organism escapes the innate immune mechanisms specific immune response is elided acquired immunity supplements the protection provided by innate immunity it requires several days to become activated unique features of acquired immunity are specificity diversity self non self recognition and immunologic memory details of this unique features of acquired immunity are as shown in chart then there are different types of acquired immunity acquired active immunity acquired passive immunity in acquired active immunity there is natural and artificial in acquired passive immunity there is natural and artificial in natural acquired active immunity immunity acquired is due to infection developed after entry of pathogens in body example a person recovered from measles infection in artificial acquired active immunity immunity is due to vaccination example polio vaccine bcg vaccine in acquired passive immunity in natural acquired passive immunity this is due to maternal antibodies that are transferred to fetus through placenta after birth in artificial acquired passive immunity this immunity is developed by injecting previously prepared antibodies using serum from humans or animals example antibodies obtained from hyperimmunized horses are injected to human against rabies pathogen cells of acquired or specific immunity are t lymphocytes that is t cells or b lymphocytes that is b cells both b and t cells are produced from pluripotent stem cells 
in red bone marrow by a process called as hematopoiesis immature lymphocytes destined to become t cells mature in thymus gland while b lymphocytes mature in red bone marrow itself after maturation they migrate to secondary lymphoid organs t cells generate cell mediated or cellular immunity they are also called as cytotoxic t cells they directly attack the invading pathogens they destroy the infected body cells and cancer cells another type of t cells is the helper t cell that stimulate b cells to grow in number and produce more antibody molecules they are also called as cd4 cells they do not attack the antigens directly b cell generate antibody mediated or humoral immunity in this b cells differentiate into plasma cells and memory cells plasma cells produce antibodies and memory cells stimulate b cells to produce antibodies antibodies are glycoproteins belonging to the class gamma globulins these are also called as immunoglobulins antibodies are produced in plasma cells in response to antigens these plasma cells produce 2000 molecules of antibodies per second structure of antibody is as shown antibody is a y shaped structure it contains four polypeptide chains two heavy also called as h chains or two light also called as l chains the four polypeptide chains are held together by disulfide bond to form y shaped structure the region holding arms and stem of antibody is termed as hinge each chain that is light and heavy chain of the antibody includes two distinct regions the variable region and the constant region variable domains of h and l chains in the arm are called as antigen fragments that is fab fragments the stem of antibody carries constant domains of heavy chains called as crystallizable fragment that is fc portion antigen antibody complex each antibody is specific for a particular antigen each antibody molecules has two arms on fc portion these possess specific antigen binding sites called as paratope at their terminal ends with the help of paratopes these antibodies attach to antigens present on bodies of virus called as epitopes and thus form antigen antibody complex these interlocking complexes keep the viruses bound together which prevent the virus from entering the cell small variations in this variable regions make each antibody highly specific for particular antigen the branch of immunology which deals with the study of antigen antibody interactions is called as serology antigens present on blood cells erythrocytes or rbcs have glycoproteins and carbohydrates in their plasma membrane they act as antigens when exposed to another person's blood they are also called as agglutinogens because they react with antibody in the plasma and show agglutination there are about 30 known antigens on the surface of human rbcs these antigens give rise to different blood groups there are many genetically determined blood systems like abo rh duffy kid lewis p mns etc abo system and rh systems are commonly used systems abo blood groups karl landsteiner in 1900 reported the presence of a b and o blood groups in human beings human blood is categorized into four types a b ab and o taking into consideration the type of antigen present on erythrocytes the chart shows human blood groups the blood groups present antigen present on rbc and antibody in plasma blood group a individuals with blood group a have the antigen a on the surface of their rbcs and b antibodies in their plasma blood group b individuals with blood group b have b antigen on the surface of rbcs and a antibodies in their plasma blood group ab 
individuals with blood group ab have both antigens a and b on their rbcs and no antibodies in their plasma blood group o individuals with blood group o lack a and b antigens on their rbcs but have both a and b antibodies in their plasma rh factor it is an antigen antigen d present on the surface of rbcs it was first discovered by leinsteiner and winner in 1940 on the surface of rbcs of rhesus monkey so it is called as rh factor persons having d antigen are called as rh positive and those lacking d antigen are called as rh negative rh antigen induces a strong immunogenic response when introduced into rh individuals rh antigen induces a strong immunogenic response when introduced into rh negative individuals rh factors is also important in blood transfusion rh type is usually combined with the abo system in a single expression such as o for type o positive ab negative for type ab rh factor is an inherited characteristic but abo blood type has no influence on rh type or vice versa immune disorders allergy allergy means hypersensitivity to a physical or chemical agent the term allergy was originally used by von pirquet allergy is an inappropriate and excessive immune response of a person to some foreign substances in this kind of immune response there is an excess production of antibodies against this substance to that an extent that they cause inflammation and damage to the body itself it is an adverse reaction by the body's immune system allergy is caused by the substances known as allergens some common allergens are dust pollens spores molds feathers fur nutrients cosmetics and many others immunodeficiency diseases immunodeficiency diseases results from failure of one or more components of immune system affected individuals are susceptible to opportunistic pathogens immunodeficiency may result from gene mutations infections or malnutrition aids acquired immunodeficiency syndrome aids is an example of immunodeficiency disease caused by the infection from a retrovirus known as human immunodeficiency virus hiv hiv has an rna genome that replicates via dna intermediate hiv selectively infects and kills t helper cells after infection the viral rna genome is reverse transcribed into dna copy by the enzyme reverse transcriptase the dna copy of hiv gets inserted into human chromosome and replicate with cellular dna and produce rna copies of the viral genome the rna copies are packaged and liberated as virus particles into the blood stream which infect and kill new t helper cells it results in decrease of t helper cells that is cd4 cells and decreases the acquired immune response and such hiv infected persons are susceptible to various opportunistic diseases like pneumonia kaposi's sarcoma tuberculosis etc which kills the aids patient